And swag football is underway in downtown Houston, Texas, and that one sails out of bounds. Howard in the backfield, standing to his left. Third and ten. Body steps up in the pocket, rolling to his right. Still looking downfield, has it, and he's caught and pushed out of bounds. A good defensive play by the Tigers from Jackson State. Leo Arrington on the stop for Jackson State. Yeah, Body did a good job of stepping up, trying to buy some time, but no one got open for him. Those receivers got to work their way back. That was a pickup of lot nine on that last play. Second and a yard. Wilkerson is hitting the backfield, spins away, and Wilkerson has a touchdown for Jackson State. And that was all on Wilkerson. Savion Wilkerson was hit, bounced off a of one tackler, bounced off another tackler, and just put the football in the end zone. And again, uh, you know, we've talked to Coach Sanders a couple times now, and the thing he says, I don't really care about anything, but we must dominate. And kick it back to a, your quarterback, and then he just winds up and throws a perfect dart in there, and there he is just rambling for the touchdown. And you can't get more wide open than that. I want to say he's probably... And now we have a third and nine for Texas Southern. Body in the pocket. Throws downfield. Has a man and a nice catch. And a big game for the Tigers from Texas Southern. 50-yard play as Body goes deep and completes his pass. What a connection here. A little bit of push off. But, hey, he did a great job and connected on that ball. Freshman. From Yates High School coming up with that big play. So this time they go inside to Jacory Howard, still on his feet. Howard at the five, and he's in for a touchdown for Texas Southern. How about that? The big man saying, You cannot tackle me. A little dance in the end zone now. But look at that right there. Once he sees that, look at he's looking around, going, Wow, there's no one around. Second down, and they go back to Wilkerson again. Puts his head down, still on his feet. Wilkerson at the 20. One man to beat. Wilkerson is in for the touchdown for Jackson State. And just like that, the Tigers from JSU answer on the other end. When he went to that line of scrimmage, let's see what happens here, because he goes in like, hey, look, there's nothing in the box. Wait a minute. He's coming out. Look what I pulled out. <laughs> He's heading for the touchdown. Absolutely. I mean, he, he looked tackled. There's no way, and he just pops right out of there. And T. Marshall checking into the backfield now. He will be at Sanders' left. He goes right up the middle, and the pressure is there, and Sanders goes down. A big pressure by that TSU defense, number 55, makes the sack on the play. Well, 6'3", 220 freshman from Stafford, and, man, he got there. He was coming home on a stunt. So my guess is the ref gave him a warning, so we'll keep an eye on that. So the punt? will be returned by Sean Xavier Lewis, and he has a lot of room, just a kicker to beat, and he beats it. Now it's a foot race, but he slowed him up just enough, but a great return by Sean Xavier Lewis. We mentioned how explosive he was. You kept saying electric, electric, and again, the light switch was fully on, no dimmer here, and it was the worst kind of, for a Jackson State perspective, the worst kind of punt you want. Very low line drive punt. Turns and he gives to Howard again. Howard with a great cut and he's in for the touchdown. Ja'Cory Howard and he set that up with a nice move. Some magic from the big fella. Ja'Cory Howard all 6'1 and 230 pounds of it. Watch number 62 as he blows up Ford. Gets in front of him. Creates an extra block there. Puts a man in motion. Shadour rolls to his right. Going to keep it. He's in for the touchdown for Jackson State. Shadour Sanders, the quarterback on the keeper, saw he had just enough room to get in there. I get a little nervous because I think he's, he's he gets he gets hit, right? He doesn't dodge away from the action, but he's calculated. He's like, okay, this is for a touchdown. I'm gonna I'm gonna pound it in there. Devin Hayes was the offensive tackle who moved a little early on that play, number 79. First down again for Jackson State. Shadur Sanders throws underneath, has Shane Hooks, and he's in for the touchdown. Shane Hooks, who's shown off that athletic ability earlier tonight. You saw a little bit of it there, the run after the catch. Watch the touch he puts on the ball. It is extremely accurate, but his receiver is able to make the easy catch. It's not drilled at him. A first down for Jackson State after the catch by Davis. Sanders on the slant route. What a nice move by Shane Hooks. 
Hook's trying to get around the outside, and he's going to be knocked down at about the 20-yard line. But a great move, C.J. Henderson. And he picks up a first down, so make it a first and goal to go for Jackson State. Shadur Sanders for the corner. Shane Hooks. And looking for a word from the official. Finally, touchdown for Jackson State. Another beautiful pass from Sanders to Shane Hooks. Beautiful. He drops it right in there. And the, and the ref was just trying to make sure he hung on, hung on to the ball. And he did. Watch. There it is. Two feet in, actually. That drive, eight plays, 75 yards, and 324 to get it in the end zone as Andrew Body keeps his biggest run of the night. And Andrew Ooh. Body, the return as he runs with the football. He just put out some frustration, is what he did right here. Watch this. Nice move there, and then right he's going to lay the hammer. Bam! And they say they're going to bring the swack with him. On third down, Shadur Sanders fires, has a man all by himself. He's battling for that first down, and he picked it up. A nice play over there. So this time Sanders throws it again. He has Gaines, and Gaines is going to pick up about six yards on the play. And for, for those of you watching at home who's not aware, so second down and four to go now for the Tigers from Jackson State. Sanders passes again, finds Hunt again. He got another first down as he steps out of bounds after he picked up the first down. Stuart Sanders hands it off to Wilkerson. He hadn't had a tote in a while, and he's making up for it. Wilkerson picked up that first down. How about that? Wilkerson with a 28-yard gain. Around 184 on the day. I would say that is quite impressive. But uh, we heard another roar that was coming <laughs> from down the street, and it was a three-run home run by Jordan Alvarez. So your World Series upset up, update the Astros go out in front three to one on that three run bomb by Jordan Alvarez and the clock is all zeros now. So that will be the end of this ball game. And Jorge, let me get some of your quick thoughts because we were just talking about the second half. We went. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube for live streaming sports and premium content. Subscribe to ESPN plus.